Hello, my name is Vendimus, and in this video, we are going to be learning about HTML elements. If you want to follow along, the link is in the description down below. Let's begin. We are at freecodecamp.org and this is the basic HTML and HTML5. It's a beginner course. So, um, this is the first challenge. It says, uh, say hello to HTML elements. Welcome to Free Code Camp's HTML coding challenges. These will walk you through web development step by step. First, you'll start by building a simple web page using HTML. You can edit code in your code editor, which is embedded into this web page. And that's this middle part here. And then I believe this is the console for the code embedded editor. Do you see the code in your code editor that says, you know, h1 in the brackets, hello, and then slash h1? That's an HTML element. Most HTML elements have an opening tag and a closing tag. And these are the examples of what they look like here. The only difference between opening and closing tags is the forward slash after the opening bracket of a closing tag. That's right here. Each challenge has tests you can run at any time by clicking the run test button. That's down here. When you pass all tests you will be prompted to submit your solution and go to the next coding challenge. To pass the test on this challenge, change your H1 element text to say hello world. So down here is your objective, your H1 element should have the text hello world. So this is what your page looks like all the way to the right. And in the middle, you have the word hello, which updates over here, I believe. If you put anything over there, yeah. So you just type in hello world, and it pops up on your web page to the right here. But if you had any questions, you could just click get help. And you can get a hint, watch a video, or even ask for help on some forums. This will be helpful later on when the challenges become more difficult. But we are going to go through all the challenges and it should be solved on these videos. But if I do have questions, because I am learning, then I will also use this. So now um, I'll show you the reset all code button. Reset this lesson. So I reset the lesson. Again, we're typing in hello world. And that appears on the web page. And then we're going to click run test. And then this one is complete. You can download your solution or you can submit and go to the next challenge. The hotkeys control plus enter for that, but I'll tell you if you do not submit, then if you leave this page 
what happens is you have to do this challenge all over again it doesn't record onto your profile you could sign in with an account and using that account it saves your progress it also gives you a cool black screen on the back instead of the bright brighter screen color so logging in is very nice for that and then I would also like to add that I have already completed this challenge I was about maybe six challenges in and I thought I'll go back and then just record the progress on my way on my way through so be sure to submit and then that will take you to the next challenge so that's gonna be it for this video thank you for watching if you feel this video was helpful or you liked it then click the like button if you want to see more content like this then subscribe and if you have any questions post them in the comments down below i am Vindimus, and i will see you later have a good day everyone thank you